Yo, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Kai Ace Limitless, and we back with another one. So, We Don't Trust You just dropped by Future and Metro, right? And we've been waiting on Future to drop for a little minute. But, you know what I'm saying? It looks like it, it already got hijacked by Kendrick Lamar going crazy on the track like that. And it was so unexpected because he wasn't even listed as a feature on the song. So Kendrick Lamar just jumps up out of nowhere and goes crazy on Drake and J. Cole. And this is his response to the first person shooter song by Drake and J. Cole. And he for sure, he got that, you know what I'm saying? He got that control energy. You know what I mean? When he dropped the control and dissed all the rappers in the industry. It looks like, you know, every couple months, you know, Kendrick Jobs said this song to Drake. And just a reminder, you know, just to put a little reminder out there that he is ready for Drake and J. Cole. He looks like he's ready to take him on at the same time. You know, pause. You know, ever since Kendrick Lamar dropped control, Drake and Kendrick, they have been, you know, doing these low key, you know, subliminal disses, right? Where it's very vague. And Kendrick Lamar is like, you know, forget all of sub subliminal disses. Like, let's just go head to head. And I think this is really more so at uh, Drake than at uh, J. Cole, right? But J. Cole, is, since he's in the mix, it's almost like he gonna catch a stray just for being next to Drake, you know what I'm saying? And when it comes to Kendrick versus Drake, it does seem like, you know what I mean, Kendrick wants Drake a little bit more than Drake wants Kendrick, you know? I don't think Drake really wants smoke with Kendrick Lamar too tough. That would be a good beef, right? I think a Kendrick Drake beef to make Drake have to, you know, pull out the pen, probably get a couple more Ghost Riders to, you know, kind of keep up with Kendrick Lamar. So let's get into some of these bars that, you know, Kendrick was dropping on Drake and J. Cole. He says, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, get up with me. Sneak this in first person shooter. I hope they came with three switches. I crash out like F rap. This Melly Mel if I had to. Got two T's with me. I'm snatching chains and burning tattoos. Lost too many soldiers not to play it safe. If we walk around with that stick, it ain't under 3K. Think I won't drop the location. I got PTSD. Mother F the big three, nigga, is just big me. Nigga, bum, what? I'm really like that. And the best work is a light pack. Nigga, Prince outlive Mike Jack. Nigga, bum for all your dogs getting buried. That's K with all three nines. He gonna see Pet Cemetery, nigga, bum. You know what I'm saying? So... Kendrick Lamar, he going in, he, he talking about for all the dogs, and, and you know what I'm saying, this was very personal, you know what I mean, Drake got 48 hours to respond to this, you know what, the funny thing is that when it comes to like a real one-on-one -on -one rap beef, we haven't seen Kendrick Lamar really go back and forth with a rapper, you know, kind of like how Drake did, you know, or Drake has a history of that, right, you know, he, he went back and forth with Pusha T and Meek Mill, I really wonder what a back and forth between Drake and Kendrick would look like in a, in a short period of time because the way they've been dissing each other would be like, you know, one song every year and it's like a subliminal diss, you know, Ken Kendrick say I'm smoking on your top five and then, you know, Drake gonna say some fly shit on like a, you know, hit song. But let me know what y'all think in the comment box, like who would y'all get when it comes to like a rap battle, you know, and a real rap beef? Who y'all got, Kendrick Lamar or y'all got Drake? Let me know what y'all think in the comment box. Appreciate y'all for rocking with me. Like the video, subscribe, and we go.